I have a 1997 Jeep Wrangler TJ, and the brake lights work except for the third one above the spare tire. The contact points for the brake lights that you will see coming up were pretty corroded, so I cleaned them up with some sandpaper and still had no luck, even using a voltmeter to test for current. Uh, and I did check the bulb first. So here I'll do a walkthrough of basically what I had to do to get it working. On the inside of the tailgate, hinge side, you will find four contacts two on the inner wall and two on the door that contact each other to create a path for when the brake pedal is pushed. I should not be able to just pull them out of the inner wall this easy. As you can see, the ends are not corroded because I first took some sandpaper and scuffed the ends up, and using a voltmeter I could not get a reading still. So what I'm going to do is go under the rear right quarter and see what else I can see and feel. To do this, I will need to remove one plastic retainer pin and just fold the plastic splash guard over. My Jeep has its share of rust and then some, and it was actually easier to pull the splash guard over the plastic retainer pin. Right away I found the two wires that go up to the contact pins and when I reached up I could feel the pins. All I needed to do was push them on until I felt them click on. So that the pins wouldn't push themselves out I just shut the tailgate to keep pressure on them. Something I would suggest but didn't have time to do would be put some uh, dielectric grease on the pins. If you look close at the wire ends, you can see some green corrosion. I should mention also that I did not have the brake lights on while doing this so that I would not blow a fuse. Moment of truth and I'm very happy. One more thing knocked off the project list for my Jeep. Thanks for watching the video. I hope it helped you out. Uh, if you have any questions, let me know. I'm sure I skipped over some things. I did this pretty quickly. But I uh, hope you enjoyed it.